Hi, I'm Tiffany Domino. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my website is howtoentrepreneur.org and my mission is to help you grow a business from idea to enterprise. So if you or someone you know wants to start or grow a business, definitely stop by howtoentrepreneur.org and check out my free course. It's a framework to help you grow your business from idea to enterprise. So today I'll be doing a review of QuickBooks Online and we'll basic, basically be analyzing whether or not this is a good software solution for you. So if you're in the market for accounting software and you're considering whether QuickBooks is a good option for you, then you're in the right place. We'll be going over the pros, the cons, and the alternatives to help you decide if this is a good accounting solution for you. So financials are a major component of business success and some of the most important business metrics are sales, revenue, profit, and expenses. So if you don't have a good way of measuring these metrics, your decision making could be incongruent to where you are. The financials serve as a GPS that tells you where you should go next in the business. And without a good accounting solution, you won't have clarity about how much is going out, how much is coming in, and the best decisions to make as a result. QuickBooks is one of the most popular accounting solutions. They help to compile pertinent metrics so business owners can have an accurate perspective of their businesses. Though they're popular, they're not the best solution for everyone, and they may or may not be the best solution for you. In this QuickBooks online review, I will tell you what it is, how it works, pros and cons, what it does well, what it does not, what others are saying, both good and bad, my recommendation, and alternatives in case you want to do some comparison shopping. So my goal is to help you decide if this is a good fit for you. So if that sounds good, let's keep going. So what is Intuit QuickBooks Online? Just as an overview, it's likely that if you've done reading on accounting, you've heard of QuickBooks, but it's less likely you know that Intuit was founded in 1983 by Steve Cook and Tom Prooks. Intuit, the maker of QuickBooks, is also the creator of TurboTax and Quicken. QuickBooks launched in 1992 and continues to update their product to be useful to more business owners. QuickBooks has dominated the market share in accounting software for nearly two decades. 600,000 accountants use QuickBooks and estimates put the company at 80 to 90 percent market share serving over 29 million businesses. So those are some interesting facts about QuickBooks. So after 34 years, Intuit is still reinventing itself in order to remain a market leader in the accounting solution space. Now they offer an online cloud-based solution as well as a desktop solution. And all of their accounting solutions integrate with hundreds of other software from tax software, timekeeping, inventory management, and so many other things. So it makes QuickBooks the optimal choice for many businesses. So how does QuickBooks Online work? QuickBooks works because it enables you to link bank accounts or manually enter financial data. Once the data is input into QuickBooks, it categorizes the expen expenses so you can get a clear view of where your money is going. With the data input and the expenses categorized, QuickBooks can be used to make reports like profit and loss statements, cash flow statements, and others that can help you to evaluate your financial standing in the business. So to compare QuickBooks Desktop versus QuickBooks Online, because you may be familiar with the, pre, the uh, QuickBooks Desktop because it's been out a lot longer. So some people prefer QuickBooks Desktop and others prefer QuickBooks Online. So a common question that people considering Quick, QuickBooks ask is which one is better, QuickBooks Desktop or QuickBooks Online? And unfortunately, it's not really a one-size-fits-all answer. They both are great programs with different features. And so I've included this video as a basic comparison because I thought it was really um it explained very well the differences, but to summarize, here are some of the perks of 
QuickBooks Desktop that QuickBooks Online does not offer. Um, for QuickBooks Desktop, you don't have a subscription. Um, you don't have automatic sales receipts. You don't have split transactions or scheduled invoices. Um, it must be downloaded so there's hard, hardware requirements and location and class categories. In contrast, here are some of the benefits QuickBooks Online offers. Um, it offers you mobility because it's cloud-based. It's easier to do collaboration. You can add users and it's really simple for them to log on. Um, you can also uh, it's, it's easier to use so it's less of a learning curve and uh, it's cloud-based so there's no hardware requirements except to print checks so it's really a preference based on how you'll be using the software but they do have a quiz on the QuickBooks website to help you decide which one is better for you so you can take the short QuickBooks quiz to decide whether or not the desktop versus the online is the best fit for you. Also, how do I how do you get started with Intuit QuickBooks Online? So, with QuickBooks does have a learning curve, but if you really want to organize your finances and understand your financial standing, it's worth it. To get started with QuickBooks, you have to number one, pick your plan. QuickBooks has three plans, the Simple Start, Essentials, and Plus, and each plan has different features. So you'll have to choose your plan based on which features you're likely to use. QuickBooks gives you the option to either have the first year at 50% off or to have a 30-day free trial when you go to howtoentrepreneur.org slash QuickBooks. Again, howtoentrepreneur.org slash QuickBooks. So if you want to experiment, try it out and see which plan would be suitable for your needs. I recommend trying the 30-day free trial option so you can give it a test drive and see if it's a good fit for you. Number two, you would create your account. So after you've chosen your plan, you'll need to create your QuickBooks account by entering some personal information such as your name, your company name, how long you've been in business, and so on. Number three, you have to customize your QuickBooks account. To customize it, you'll want to input the details of your business, the color palette and logo of your business. Customizing your account will enable you to have continuity in your branding, even on your invoices and estimates. You'll also be able to link your account so the QuickBooks dashboard can accurately show you your business financial metrics. So who is Intuit QuickBooks Online for? QuickBooks works, works best for small and medium-sized businesses, those who need an accounting solution, those who have tried a software like FreshBooks but have found it to be too simple, or maybe you've tried Xero or NetSuite and you found it to be too complex. So if you're switching from a different alternative, uh, QuickBooks is definitely one to look at. Um, people who want to organize their business finances. It's also for people who want to easily create financial statements and those who want an easy way to manage business finances for others because they also have their QuickBooks Pro account. So Intuit QuickBooks Online, as far as the tools and training, QuickBooks offers a blog and several video training tutorials to help you learn to use QuickBooks effectively. You can take a look at their video tutorials. I have a link inside of this post and I'll leave a link to this post in the description box below so you can stop by and take a look at whichever resources you are interested in. So as far as the QuickBooks um, online support, QuickBooks is working to improve their customer support. Currently they offer a blog, a resource center, live chat, phone support, and classes to help customers and potential customers navigate the challenges with QuickBooks. What does Intuit QuickBooks Online do well? There's a large network of accountants who are familiar with QuickBooks. Like I mentioned before, there's over 600,000 accountants that use QuickBooks. So if you were working on your own finances and you needed some help, you can have one of the um, QuickBooks accountants, possibly even in your area, that would be able to help you out. 
QuickBooks enables you to give access to your accountants so they can work on your books remotely. They integrate with very popular softwares like tax software, CRM software, HR software, and others to make operating your business succinct and easy. They've made a cloud-based solution so you don't have to download software if you don't want to, and that can make it easier on the storage um, of your computer. And it performs cash, cash basis and accrual accounting. Um, you also have invoice tracking, scheduling invoices, and QuickBooks is very versatile across industries. So what doesn't QuickBooks do well? Um, customer complaints suggest that it's difficult to transition to QuickBooks or from QuickBooks to another accounting software after regular use. Customers also say that the support options aren't adequate, so it's slow to reach a support representative. And reviews also suggest that QuickBooks doesn't work as well in manufacturing style businesses. So as far as um, the reviews and what others are saying both good and bad about QuickBooks online, as the market leader in accounting software, QuickBooks has lots of customer reviews. They have 1,716 reviews at a 3.9 star average rating on G2 Crowd. Then they have 10.9, um, 10,900 reviews with an average 4.4, 4.4 out of 5 on iTunes. And so I've done a little roundup of the reviews that I found online so that you can hear from other people what they have to say about QuickBooks and decide based on their experiences whether or not this could be a good fit for you. So I've compiled a playlist. This playlist has nine videos um, with different people who are saying their experiences with using QuickBooks. So that could be helpful so that you can decide if that's a good option for you. Also, um, the most helpful positive Intuit QuickBooks Online review that I found is by a reviewer named Sherry G at Capterra. And this is what she said about QuickBooks. She said, I've been using QuickBooks since 1995. And as far as the pros, she said, I like how easy it is to keep track of my check register. Vendors, customers do my payroll every week, enter and pay bills and find things when necessary. It is a reliable accounting software that is used by millions of people, so it is pretty easy to take my reports into my account each year and have her do my taxes. I own a small business with four or more employees, and QuickBooks has made it possible for me to do my own books all these years and keep better track of what is going on with our finances. For the cons, she said, I am not wild about the way the payroll add-on renews. You have to buy an additional module or whatever you want to call it to keep the payroll tables updated. For some reason, the updating can be very iffy, and I will go to do my payroll and suddenly can't do it. Of course, this only happens when there is a time crunch and I need to quickly whip out some paychecks, but for the most part, the software works so well that I forget about this problem fairly easily. And then she says, overall, I've had a wonderful experience with QuickBooks over the years. I have, I have to buy the updates, but I find somewhere online that I can get the latest for, the, for less than buying it direct, and I'm able to keep my version pretty up to date. Using a different and early DOS accounting software was so complex that I couldn't even figure out how to open up the software and get started. I cut my losses and purchased QuickBooks. I took a local course on how to use QuickBooks and was off to the races immediately. If you are not really terrific with software, it might be a good idea just to pay someone like an enroll agent to come in and install the QuickBooks for you and get your accounting set up. Later on when you've been working on the software for years, it is worth it to have started out correctly with some professional help. I have my accountant come into my office every year or two and go over my books to make sure everything is looking good. Entrances are correctly attributed and so on. That gives me a good feeling that I know I can rely on my information in QuickBooks. Anyway, I do recommend this software. I'm a computer professional, a web developer, 
but was a CPA secretary, secretary, went through a word processing course in the early 1980s, then became a paralegal and continued my computer education at the university here. Then went into business with my husband, so I'm quite familiar with QuickBooks. So I thought that review was very thorough and helpful, so that's why I've included it because I thought it was a really, really helpful, positive review. Um, so. Also, I like to include negative reviews as well so that you can get a balanced perspective of what type of customers may have liked QuickBooks versus what type of customers may have not. So you can see uh, where you fit into the spectrum. So this is a negative review by Perry G from Captera and he says for the pros QuickBooks does everything I needed to do simple input after my accountant set it up some nice reports easy to read screens and easy for me to produce P&L profit and loss for myself and taxes as far as the cons he says it's terrible support I had issues with some items and waited for hours on hold spoke to people with such strong accents I cannot understand them I was actually stuck and could not work and asked to be escalated to North American support they said they could not do that they offered me a manager and hung up on me I called the corporate office and even sent letters and never got any responses very frustrating when you spend this kind of money and the support is not there as far overall he said, I actually stopped using it and moved over to Sage software. When the program will not open to wait for 90 minutes on hold for support is not business functional. The product is good when it works, but if you have any issues, be prepared to stop your business. So as you can see, that's a pro and that's a con. Um, some people don't don't have to deal a lot with the support and some people um, some people do and you do want to be able to have um, good support if you need it so those are some things to consider when you're looking for an accounting solution um, so as far as the Intuit QuickBooks Online price QuickBooks Online has four pricing options they have the simple essentials plus and self-employed and they range between five and thirty dollars per month unless you add additional features like the basic or the full service payroll so I'll let you have a look here as you can see um, with the um, you have the different accounts that also have um, different numbers of users that you can add and um, you can see that the features vary across the different accounts of course and you can also add on payroll self-service payroll full service payroll or employee time tracking onto the software so you can definitely stop by if you go to how to entrepreneur.org slash quickbooks and you'll be able to um, check out all of the pricing plans and the differences and things like that Overall, QuickBooks is a market leader for a reason. They have a very good software that's helpful to millions of businesses. The software is versatile across industries, so it can work well for construction companies and retail companies alike, which makes it ideal for accounting professionals managing several clients. So if you're interested in giving QuickBooks a try, then check out howtoentrepreneur.org slash QuickBooks and sign up for their 30-day free trial. Um, as If you're still looking for some alternatives, maybe QuickBooks is a good option for you, but you want to see others out there in the market, I recommend you take a look at FreshBooks. It's an alternative accounting software that has Created for, that has been created for freelancers and small to medium sized agencies. It has a very simple user interface and customer reviews suggest that it's, it may be easier to use for many people who don't need all of the robust features of QuickBooks. They also have award winning customer support so a lot of the complaints that you hear about QuickBooks are related to their support and you wouldn't have that problem so much with FreshBooks. So you can check out my full FreshBooks review um, inside of this post. And like I said, I'll leave a link to this QuickBooks review in the description box. And when you stop by How to Entrepreneur, you can check out any resources that you'll be interested in. Also, 
Um, another alternative is Briefcase by AppSumo, and they offer many software solutions for things ranging from project management to productivity, and they have a plan where you have access to a briefcase of some of their most popular software and accounting software is included in that briefcase. So inside of the briefcase is pretty much every popular software that will help you to run your business. It's really a full, fully rounded, uh, a full stack briefcase with software solutions. So you can definitely check out more about um, the AppSumo briefcase and um, the link is in the article as well. You can see my full review of the AppSumo briefcase. I thought it was very nice and something you should consider if you're in the market for accounting software and other small business software solutions. So that's all I have for this review. I'm really hoping that it was helpful for you and helped you to decide whether or not QuickBooks Online is a good option for you. If it was, please leave a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more reviews like this where I do, um, or more videos where I do product and service reviews as well as buyer's guides, or also growth strategies um, to help you grow your business from idea to enterprise, then subscribe to this channel and click the bell icon so you can be notified of upcoming videos. So that's all I have for you. If you haven't already, stop by Hot Entrepreneur and check out the free e-course. It's a framework to help you grow your business from idea to enterprise. So I look forward to seeing you in the next video and have a great day. Bye.